So the issue here is that there is up and down play or slop between the head and the main shaft. Now this up and down play, can't see it too well but you can hear it, is enough to cause about a half a degree of a blade pitch, a difference between the lower and the upper position of the uh, head. Why does this happen? Well, the, um, the way these uh, um, uh, holes are machined in both the head and the main shaft, the holes tend to be uh, slightly uh, larger uh, diameter than the Jesus bolt itself. And of course, since uh, there is uh, the, these, uh, the hole is slightly larger than the, than the bolt, there is going to be some uh, uh, play. That's just the way it is. Now this is a um, Synergy E5 helicopter, but this, this is true of all the other helicopters I have owned. Goblins, Logos, Miniature Aircraft, Align, etc. Uh, so how do you get rid of this uh, up and down play? Well, what, uh, what the manual tells you is to tighten these uh, washout arms uh, so that uh, the head, you know, clamps onto the uh, main shaft and that should eliminate the up and down play. In reality, uh, I, I haven't found out that to work 100%. First of all, you have to tighten uh, the screw pretty tight. And despite the best efforts, uh, you may still um, have a little bit of play, which may uh, be more uh, evident when you uh, do uh, maneuvers that involve uh, going uh, down and up on the pitch like when doing tech talks and so forth. So my prefer way, uh, preferred way of uh, eliminating this issue is to use uh, uh, shims. Um, I tend to use shims um, uh, on top of the uh, main shaft so it sort of shims the head up a little bit so you know the uh, shim will sit inside of the um, uh, of the head uh, the shims that I'm using uh, here these are uh, for a 10 millimeter shaft I use number six uh, shims that you can get at Home Depot Lowe's I got these at uh, Strauss Snyder's um, the deal with these uh, uh, shims is that the outer diameter is slightly um, smaller than the 10 millimeter diameter of the shaft. So this is a 9.5 or so. So this would work very well. The thickness uh, for this one in particular is 0.88. And through trial and error, I figured that I need uh, 0.98. Okay, so how do I, so what did I do? Well, I reduced the um, thickness of one of the shims uh, using a, a file, okay? So I'm using two shims and I just reduced the thickness of one shim so that uh, I put the, these two shims uh, together and the uh, thickness, um, came out to, uh, you know, about uh, 0.98, okay, these are the two shims. So uh, what I do with the shims, I put them um, on top of the um, main shaft, then um, I'll insert the head carefully, so not, okay, and check this out. When I uh, introduce this uh, uh, Jesus bolt, it might be a little tight to, to get it in there, but, you know, there's no no up and down play okay there's just no play whatsoever and that's uh even before i uh i uh tightened the uh uh the washout arms so the, the, the play is gone so the whole point uh, here is that by using uh, shims between the main shaft and the head you can eliminate this uh up and down play uh, very effectively thank you for watching